Did you know that cardiac arrest causes about 300,000 to 450,000 deaths in the United States each year? What's up everyone? In today's video, we're going to explore the purpose of an automated external defibrillator or an AED, how to use them effectively during emergencies, and essential safety tips. An AED is a crucial device used to revive individuals experiencing sudden cardiac arrest, which is a condition where the heart's electrical activity becomes disrupted, leading to a dangerously fast heartbeat. All right, so what's the purpose of an AED? The primary purpose of an AED is to provide a shock that can help the heart reestablish an effective rhythm. Early defibrillation significantly increases the chance of survival for victims of sudden cardiac arrest. There are two types of AEDs, semi-automated and fully automated. Semi-automated AEDs require user intervention to deliver a shock, while fully automated AEDs deliver a shock automatically if commanded by the device software. Now let's understand how to use an AED effectively during an emergency situation. Step 1. Turn on the AED. The device will provide step-by-step -step voice instructions on checking for breathing, pulse, and positioning electropads on the person's chest. Step two, deliver the shock. If the AED detects an abnormal heart rhythm requiring a shock, it prompts the user to stand back and press the button to deliver a shock. Step three, administer CPR if necessary. Start CPR after the shock is delivered if CPR is still needed. The AED will guide users through the CPR process. If a victim has a hairy chest, check the AED for a razor or a second set of pads. If a razor is available, shave the areas where the pads will be applied. If no razor is available, apply pads to rip off the chest hair and reapply a new set of pads onto the skin. If the victim is submerged in water or is wet, remove them from the water source and quickly dry them before applying the pads. If the victim has an implanted device like a pacemaker or a defibrillator, avoid placing the pads over the implants. And finally, if the victim has a transdermal medication patch, remove the patch and wipe away as much medication possible before you apply the AED pads. Children and infants can also be treated with an AED using pediatric or adult electro pads and a pediatric key or attenuator. You can use adult pads for children eight years or older. Adult pads can also be used on children younger than eight years old, but they'll have to be applied a little differently. Apply one pad to the front of the chest and the other pad to the back so they do not touch. Once the pads are attached, follow the instructions given by the AED. All AEDs must undergo regular maintenance, including checking and changing batteries, electro cables, and pads. Always follow the manufacturer's instructions for proper maintenance. Here are some safety tips to keep in mind when using an AED. Buy FDA-approved devices, register the AED with the manufacturer, conduct practice runs, store the AED in an accessible place, and ensure the proper maintenance. It's essential to train workers to recognize sudden cardiac arrest, perform CPR, provide early defibrillation with an AED, and care for the victim until emergency services arrive. Formal training for AED use is not required. However, AED and CPR certifications are recommended to help increase your comfort and confidence. AEDs are intended to be used by the general public with or without specialized training. For more information and training resources, visit the Occupational Safety and Health Administration's website or consult organizations such as the American Heart Association and the American Red Cross. AEDs play a vital role in saving lives during emergencies. Remember, prompt defibrillation significantly increases the chances of survival. By following proper procedures and maintaining your AED, you can make a difference in emergency situations. I'm Brooklyn with JJ Safety. Thanks for watching. Stay safe and always be prepared. For more information, visit us online at jjsafetyllc.com or call us at 866-627-3850.